everybody. Ken Gonzalez for George Langevin Productions bringing you another game of the week. The Benicia Arsenal and the New Mexico Strikers squaring off here in this 8-on-8. Eight eight. Quite young. There's a shot to the net. And that ball's going to find the back of the net. A goal for the Benicia Arsenal as they trail 1-0. And here come... Benicia again, that shot is going to be just a little bit wide, rolling here to the near corner. For the Benicia Arsenal, who are up 1-0, shot to the net, over the crossbar, and out of play. It'll be a goal kick here. For First touch by New Mexico, but taken away here on the near side. Ruiz's cross, just a little bit long, got away from Cade Curtola. High and over the hands of the keeper, Paquin, number 10 with the score Michael Soto puts the Benicia Arsenal up 2-0 all to the back line now comes in there's a little flick with the foot and that ball is going to find the back of the net nice tandem work right there into the middle, Joshua Ortero now to the far side. Shot to the goal off the hands of the keeper, Cameron Finch. And then knocked out of play by his teammate, Curtola. Pass one defender. There's a shot to the net. Just past the diving keeper, Aiden Paquin and Cade Curtola. Puts the fourth score on the board. Soto makes his move to the back line. There's a cross to header. Nice attempt. Now the strikers are coming in. They get an attempt shot. Nice, nice block by Cameron Finch, the keeper. I Will it stay in play? It does. And the shot to the net over Finch. And the end of this first half. We're at the 2015 Mayor's Cup International Tournament. Ken Gonzalez for George Langevin Productions. And it has been all Benicia Arsenal with a 4-0 lead. Kate Curtola with the scores. Not all of them, but a few of them. That's how we're going to halftime. We'll take a break and be right back in just a few minutes. Shot deflected away by the defender over the oh right to the keeper. I thought it was going to go over his head. Benicia spreading the field to the back line. There's a cross of the header over the crossbar. Nice setup, nice play by the Arsenal. Into the middle, deflected away by the keeper. Nice play by Aiden Paquin. And they do try off the hands of the keeper, Cameron Finch. And he's able to recover. Ivan Zakas with the shot on goal. Here's the kick. Right into the steady hands of Cameron Finch. Luis Martinez shot to the net. Nice save. Not sure if that would have gone in if Cade changes directions once, twice. Shot to the net. And that ball will find the back of the net just inside the corner post there. And the outstretched hands of the keeper, Aiden Paquin and Cade Curtola. There's a shot to the goal and right to Paquin. Michael Soto. Now number 13, Jesus Mendoza weaves his way right down the middle of the field. He's going to try it with the right leg just wide of the net. Number 12 with a shot to the net. There's a kick high into the air. And again, a nice stop. Number 14, Luis Martinez to the net, off the post, and the second attempt will score it. That ball finds the back of the net, and the strikers are on the board. A 
Number six with a shot to the goal just over the crossbar. Left legged shot by Ivan Zakas. Trying to set something up. Finch. There's the pass. Kurtola. His shot on goal is deflected away by the keeper. Nice save by Aiden Pekin. Ball back up to midfield, across midfield. One on one, a shot to the goal. Too easy right there, Michael Soto. That's a, just an easy one. You got one on one against the keeper. And the odds are always with the striker on that one. Alex Colon has done a good job for the strikers today. Shot to the goal, just wide of the net. He was going for it right there. The Benicia Arsenal six, the New Mexico strikers one. Ken Gonzalez from George Landsman Productions coming at you from the 2015 Mayor's Cup International Tournament at Kellogg's Air Soccer Complex. It was my pleasure to bring you this match, and I hope to see you all again here next year. Hi, I'm Joshua Otero, and I am number eight, and I play right defense. So, um, talk a little bit about the game. Um, I thought I could have played a little bit harder because I don't think I was playing my best. Um, how do you like, have you ever been in this tournament? Um, well, we played here a long time ago, but I don't, I don't know if it's the same tournament. Well, since you're here now, how do you like, like Las Vegas or this Mayor's Cup tournament? How do you like it? Yeah, I like it. I like this place a lot. Okay. What school do you go to? I go to Sunset View Elementary in Albuquerque, New Mexico. What grade are you? I'm in, in fifth grade. All right. Cool. You want to say hi to anyone at home, mom, dad, or pets, or um, grandma? Hi to my family and my friends. Cool. Hi, my name's Easton Faria. Um, I'm number 10, and I'm left defense, or sometimes play up for a little bit. Um, how, how do you feel like you did? Today, how could you play better next time, or how do you feel about today's game? Well, I thought I could make some better passes and um, not get too nervous before the game or in the game. Yeah. And um, how do you like this particular tournament that you're in? I mean, Las Vegas, is this like the first time here? Or? Uh, no, we, yeah, we, like uh, Josh said, we uh, played here a little bit, a little bit ago, and we played up. Did you guys do any stuff in town? Like, the circus, circus uh, we're actually staying at a hotel in Circus Circus. And, uh, what school you go to? I'm in uh, my, I'm in LB uh, Lyndon B Johnson Middle School, and I'm in sixth grade. Is there anyone at home you want to say hi to your parents or? Um, the rest of my family in New Mexico and some of my friends. Hi, my name is Aiden Pickwin, and I'm, and I'm ten years old, and the position I play is keeper and defense. And uh, how do you talk about this game? How do you feel you could do better next time? or how you um, The thing I could do better next time is get on my toes and be ready to react, f to, f to like, dive to the sides and save the goals. And how do you like, in, in, like Las Vegas or the Mayor's Cup, this particular tournament? How do you, is it good? What's different about it from at home? Um, I like this tournament because it, it like, um, how do I say? It would make us get better and continue doing good. And what school are you going? What grade are you? I go to. Uh, I'm in fifth grade, and I go to Burnley Elementary. And anyone at home you want to say hi to? Parents? Yeah, I want to say hi to my my family and my grandma. Hi, my name is Alex Wagner. I'm number 21, and I play striker in left mid. So, how do you? Feel you could do better next time compared to this game. Well, well, I think we could. Um, I could play it like better all around, passing, dribbling, shooting. With one of the shots on the goal, I missed, and I think I could have shot on target. And with all my dribbling skills, I could have done better. And how do you like? Like, is this your first trip to Las Vegas? How do you like this tournament? Yeah, this is my first trip to Las Vegas. Um, we, I like it here, except the um, the only thing is is that it's uh, thicker than in uh, New Mexico, and it makes it a little different. 
And what grade are you in? What school do you go to? I, I'm in fifth grade and I go to an Anji charter school. Hello, my name is Jalen Lucero. I'm number 11 and I play striker and right mid. And how do you feel like you guys did this game or did you get your better? I feel like in the beginning of the game we started out sloppy and we could have done better. And then towards the end of the game we started to pick up the pace and take some of the possession. And how do you, uh, is this your first trip to Las Vegas? And if so, how do you like this tournament? And this no, this is not my first trip to Las Vegas. I've been here a couple times for the same soccer tournament. And how do you like this tournament? This is a fun tournament because there's a lot of competitive teams. How is it different from when you've done other ones you've done here or at home? This tournament's different from the ones in New Mexico because the talent's a lot better and it's more competitive. What grade are you in? What school are you going to? I am in fifth grade and I go to Ventana Ranch Elementary School. And is there anyone at home that you want to say hi to? Yeah, I want to say hi to my mom and my cats and my dog and the rest of my family. I was pretty excited when I got the goal. But I knew since we were still losing and we still needed to catch up more to just get, to don't worry about it and just go and try to get another one. Uh, my name is Julian Wanosta and I'm number 11. And I've, I sometimes play center defense and right defense. And how, um, how do you feel you can improve next, like your next game compared to how you guys play today? I think I can, I can improve in like a lot by like controlling the ball and don't do any turnovers. And um, how do you think the other team maybe did better than you guys that you could imitate them next time? Um, I think the other team was better at controlling the ball and passing the ball and positioning with the ball than us. And have you been to this tournament before? No. So this is your first time here, so how do you like this tournament and Las Vegas in general? I, I like this tournament because we get to travel and I like traveling and I like Vegas because it's nice. Do you do any fun stuff there with mm, you? Mm, no, not really. Okay. Um, what grade are you and what school are you? I'm in fifth grade and I go to Painted Sky Elementary School. And is there anyone at home you want to thank or maybe your coach? Yeah, like for, for, um, I want to thank my coach that I'm in this team and I want to say hi to all my family and my mom and dad. Hi, my name is Luis Martinez. I am striker and I'm 11 years old. And um, how do you feel like for the next time you could do better to win the next game? I think I, I, next time I'm going to do better by um, passing, opening up, talking more, and that's it. And you said you're at 11. What grade are you in and what school do you go to? Um, I go to Emerson and I'm in fifth grade. And is this your first time at this tour? No, this is my second time in this tournament. So how do you like Mayor's Cup compared to other tournaments you've been? I like this this tournament because there's competitive teams and you could learn from the things that they do. So that's what I like about this. Is there anyone maybe at home, there's friends or family or parents you want to say, say hi to and thank them for sending you? Uh, my, all my family. Hi, my name is Jesus and I'm number 13. I play striker, right mid, and a little bit of defense. And this was a tough loss. How do you guys think you could do better next time so that you come out? We could listen to our coach and do better and pass and open up. And how about your, you personally, your own play? Um, passing more and controlling the ball more and with my spacing. And have you ever been in this tournament? No. So it's your first time here. How do you like the Mayor's Cup tournament and the City of Las Vegas? 
I like it because it's more competitive and we get to play against different teams. How do those teams compare to like the ones back then? Um, they're more competitive and they have more talent. And uh, what grade are you in? I'm in sixth grade and I go to Sad Valley Academy. Is there anyone you want to thank uh, for sending you here? Yeah, I want to thank my family, my mom and dad, my grandma and my auntie and my grandpa and my coach. Uh, this is Mark Lucero, coach of the uh, Strikers, New Mexico Select Strikers. Um, love this tournament here in Vegas. It's always fun. It's always nice weather. Uh, the competition is fantastic for the boys to come out and play. Uh, these teams are always top notch and will always push us to the limits. Uh, very excited to actually have this video done now so I can go home and break down some tape and show these kids. Uh, exactly what I'm talking about when I'm talking about spacing, uh, passing and opening up, not watching their passes, and a lot of little fundamentals and the execution things that I'm uh, that I'm asking them to do day in day out. Um, I am very proud of these boys. They they always work hard. They always push themselves uh, to the to the limit. And uh, I ask a lot of them, and they always give me. So uh, love these boys and excited to uh, continue to coach this team and get them better. Strikers up! Strikers up!